welcome back to another episode of Nice Tries. Today, we have discovered something very interesting in our uh, Mountain Blade playthrough here. We can find where we've heard rumor of the people we're looking for last being. So, Regia, uh, she was last seen, seen near Sagora. So, we will head towards Sagora and see if we can find her. Uh, where is Sagora? Over here. Alright, well, kind of back near where we came, but it's something. It's progressly. Actually, we should track down uh, the other dude first. Uh, she was just the one I happened to pull up. How did we get there? How do we get to that screen? Hang on. How did I get to that screen? I don't even know. How did I get there? I found that inf that information and I was like, uh, well. Rip. How do we get back to that? Uh, I clicked on this name? Ah, that's right. So I clicked on the name, took us to the encyclopedia, then I went back here. Then we went to... Kingdoms. Then I picked the kingdom. So we need to find... The other dude we haven't talked to yet is... The... Nope. We've talked to Kaladog. We need to talk to Mochug. Right? I think Monchug? I don't remember talking to Monchug, at least. He was last year near Aragon. Is that closer? It is much closer. Alright, so that's all I want to see. You know, make sure that we don't go the wrong direction when we're near one of the dudes. So I think, let's check real quick, make sure we haven't talked to Mochug before. We have not talked to Mochug before. Okay, cool. So this will be the last two, and then we'll decide uh, who we want to uh, swear our loyalty to. That's going to happen at the end of this episode, one way or the other. We have not set a timer for this episode because uh, I'm determined that this will occur. And so, you know, you might see some fast forwarding here because I'm not going to make you th sit through all of this if uh, this does take a while. But guarantee by the end of this episode, we'll have sworn fealty to somebody. Hopefully it ends up being a good choice for us, but we will see. Uh, go to the arena. Oh, there's a tournament here too. Well, obviously we got to enter the tournament. And if it's a helmet, we're leaving. We're leaving. Sorry, guys. This is not worth my time. Not worth my time. All right, uh, let's go to the, not the arena, the keep. Yes, let me in the keep, sir. This is not, this is not the man I was looking for. You do not look like the man I was looking for. Is your name Mochug? Your pardon, I did not catch your name. Can I ask your name? Yes, 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 you're very important. Nope, we gotta talk to Regia. All right, fine, 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 fine. Worth a shot. We're blowing through money just paying to enter these keeps, which is a bit ridiculous. Um, well, let's check our log and see if we can't Figure out where he is currently. So we gotta go kingdoms. Uh, he's the leader of the Kutzite. Last seed near Aragorn today. All right, well, uh, I guess we'll just uh, patrol around. Check out this castle. Maybe he's in this castle. Hello, sir. I would like to go into the castle. Nobody's in here. All right, cool. Uh, well, I thought we were a genius. And we had figured it all out, but maybe we're not. Maybe it's just being a little bit vague and I need to be a bit more patient with my looking around. You know what? Let's fight these forest bandits on the way. We gotta have a little bit more combat action here. Uh, we're gonna fight these forest bandits. This one will probably be pretty hard. This is a lot of bandits and bandits are a good bit more difficult. Uh, so what we're gonna do is a little bit different. Than oh, nope, 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 nope. Sorry. Don't give them any orders. No orders, no orders. So we're going to try and take on these guys as best as we can solo to start. Uh, to really try and, you know, poke some holes in their ranks, delay them a bit. I would like our archers to come in and do some work. Uh, but they also have archers, which is going to make our lives a lot harder than it usually is. That was unfortunate. Uh, maybe we need our boys to come. You know what? Get in there, boys. Okay, that did so much damage to my horse. Oh my god. So yeah, this is the kind of combat we got to get ourselves ready for, though. Because uh, we're going to be going against these kind of dudes pretty soon here. Uh, guys, to me. Men, how many archers do they have? Are they just all archers? Well, that's an awful matchup, but they're just literally all archers. Okay, I did not expect that. Uh, I would not have ridden in as I did there uh, had I known that were the case. But you know what? Let's watch a little bit of this battle unfold. You know, get a little bit of a cinematic view here as our boys are mowed down by archers. Uh, where are our archers? We have tons of archers. Why are we not shooting at them? Why are we not shooting at him? Because I told him to charge, that's why. Oh, there are boys coming in with a sweeping attack. Alright, so this is not going great, but now that we're in their ranks, we should be pretty well off against our archers. Now that we're in close. Are my boys running? You cowards, get back here! This should be fine. You're in their ranks now. You should be totally fine. Okay, they ran in, then ran back to set up camp to shoot at them? What is this AI? Like, obviously the archers shouldn't run in there. I gotta figure out a way to give them more specific instructions. But it looks like we'll be victorious here. Uh, looks like we're gonna take some pretty heavy casualties, unfortunately. That's okay, our Vlandian Knight is doing work. 
As long as we don't lose our mounted units or our trained archers, I think I'm pretty happy with it. All right, was not ideal. We lost 16 dudes. Wow, that is unfortunate. Uh, I mean, that's what tends to happen when I go down as early as I did there. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Well, we'll take these guys. They're at least somewhat better troops. Uh, we need some more archers, I think, but that's tough. Having that many archers against us is really, really rough. Uh, that's a lot of stuff, though. I do like all that stuff we got. So, you know, higher risk, but definitely higher reward as well. Uh, now we can spend our time riding around and healing while we look for this dude who's supposed to be here. Looters. Lo 29 looters? Can we take on 29 looters? I bet we could. I bet we could. We're super, we're super low. What am I doing? Surrender or die, sir. Do we have to send troops? We have to send troops. Send in the troops! That was a crushing victory. Wow. All right. Uh, apparently, looters are just significantly easier. I knew that they were easier than uh, our other dudes, but I didn't know that they were that much easier than bandits. I would have been a little bit more cautious going against that many bandits. But hey, it's been a while since we gotten ourselves in over our head. You live and you learn. We uh, we certainly learned, uh, even if a lot of our dudes did not live, unfortunately. Uh, my bad, guys. My bad. I don't want to fight all these looters right now. I want to find this dude. You, sir, where are you? Chikan, where the heck is Chikan? Where's that? Where is it? How did you get all the way over here? Well, like I said, this might take us a little while. Keep an eye out, make sure we don't pass him. That'd be embarrassing if we passed him and I didn't notice. He'll have an exclamation point on him, so it should be easy to- There he is! Mochug! Mochug! Don't you dare leave me! Mochug! Sir, I have, I have urgent business with you. That uh, business is assess your character and see if you are as gross as you look. Yours is not a face I know. What is your name, stranger? I am Mochug, Khan of the Kutsites. I am Lord of Imperala, Makeb, and Chikan. I don't know your name, but no matter. Some say it is great honor to be found in a great lineage than to be born in one. Yes, the Emperor of Netzeris had offered to hire our warriors as mercenaries. I saw nothing wrong with that. The Empire was an old bear, well-fed, slow-moving. It wanted to keep what it had. The Stygians were, uh, and are, hungry wolves, like us. Sometimes wolves hunt in packs, sometimes they don't. Sometimes the one wolf wants the lion to kill his rival. Most of those went to... Most of those who went were Kyrgyz. They're a young clan. Their lineage not like ours. They were always looking to improve themselves. Anyway, at the battle, their Noyan, Gotug, was slain alongside the men, most of the males of his house. What can I say? A thirst for glory is dangerous, both to the thirsty one and to those around him. Clans rise, clans fall. My duty is to all the Kutsites. Look at it this way. Were it not for her husband's death, Lady Musi would never have inherited the leadership of the Kyrgyz. Death creates opportunity. Survivors of a great battle make a great show of mourning, but inside they rejoice. Alright, I don't like him. I don't like him. He's got a weird attitude, and I'm not about it. So we're going to find our last girl here. Uh, should be only one more. And it's Regagagagaga, who is from where our hometown is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where were you last seen? Near Lycaron? All right, I can handle that. That's where you were before, so it means you haven't moved in a while. Please stay there for the rest of time. Check out the arena. There's a tournament. Let's join a tournament. If there's a helmet, we're leaving. Not a helmet? We'll take some armor. Uh, you know, our, our troops still need armor. Our companions and such. Wow. Get it? Betting is starting to become not worth it. Ooh, I'm sorry, girl. That was right to your face. You are not very good at this. Wow. She's not very good at that at all. 
I mean, she is a shield maid, not a sword maid, so makes sense. She did have a shield, though, so you thought she'd be okay. Stab him. There it is. Oh, I want an overhand slash there. Overhead. You read me. You read me like a book. Probably because I called it out loud. Ow, okay. Well done, sir. Well done. Respect, respect. There it is. All right, for an infantryman, he did uh, pretty well there. All right. Skip it up. We're not going to bet. We don't need to bother betting. Oop, block our boy. Block for our boy. All right, nicely done. Screwed her around. Let, him, let her get shot in the back. Or we can just kill her because we're strong. Oop, that was not the kind of slash I wanted. Girl, how slow are you that you can't even turn around when I'm fully behind you? Ow! Okay, that was, I can't believe we got that block off. Okay, well done, well done. I, I, okay. Well done, sir. I thought she was toast before that arrow hit, but apparently not. Okay, well done. Okay, you mind shooting this guy in the back, please? You, you got this, dude? You got this? Okay, uh, that shot, I, I swear I would have gotten a, a hit off there, but all right, cool. That knight is gone. You need to work on your skills, sir. You have an arrow sticking out of your hand, so okay. I'll, I'll let it go this time. Uh, you know, I think I'd have a little bit of trouble aiming too if I had an arrow sticking out of my hand. Okay, we blocked it for him. That's all we can ask for. 72 damage. Wow, that guy's already like dead. And he actually is dead now. Dang. Okay, that hurt a lot. Why, dude, what is with these people's armor? Like, how is this armor that good? That doesn't make any sense. Three damage. Like, what the heck? Two damage. I'm hitting good shots. Like, these shots do so much more damage against anyone else. Good lord. I just bounce off him. What's a guy to do? Like, what can I do differently here? He doesn't have a shield. I'm just literally just against it. What can I do? There we go. You got to get a little more momentum. Whack him in the face. Still, the only 30 damage for a strong hit straight to the jaw? Man, armor makes an insane amount of difference in this game. Good lord. All right, we're going straight for the chest stab right in his face. I did I did 8 damage with that stab right to his face. I called my shot. Executed it perfectly. Did 8 damage. Sometimes I don't understand some things about this game. Look at that, though. We got him right in that eye. Yikes. All right. Got some sweet armor. We'll compare that to our current armor. If it's better, we'll throw it on. If not, we'll give it to uh, probably Para, given that she's been with us the longest. How's it look? Better than our current armor? The same as our current armor, but way lighter. Wow. Okay, so we'll take that because it's super light. I love that. Uh, and we'll give this to Para. Hello there, miss. Oops, that was the wrong thing. Check that out, girl. Now you'd be better off. We should buy her a saddle eventually. We should buy everyone on our squad a saddle, honestly. All right, uh, hopefully we didn't waste too much time and let her get away. Uh, we should actually check before we go off in the wrong direction. Make sure. There's got to be a better way to open that page, but, you know, hey, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Near Rote. Where the heck is Rote? That seems like it's far away. What the heck? Why did you have to run in the opposite direction? You couldn't have come towards me? Hopefully she came back to Lyca Lycaron? <gasps> She's here! Oh my goodness! Hello, miss! First, recruit some troops. And then let's find her. Let's find her. There's so many quests here. That's insane. Let's talk to her. Did not let us? Hello? Oh. Okay, so we need to go into the keep. That makes sense. Uh... Okay, all right, cool. So we've already paid a bribe to get in here so we didn't have to do it again. Uh, you look so different than you did in your picture because of your headdress. Regia, your pardon. I did not catch your name. I'm Regia, rightful empress of the Calvarians. I'm Lady of Lycaron and Dornira. I've heard your name. People speak of your deeds. It is good to finally meet you. What can you tell me about the Battle of Pendraic? Of course, I did not witness the battle, but my husband, Arnikos, frequently speaks of it. 
He was one of the Emperor's trusted commanders. Oh, she, he's dead, so it's a past tense, okay? He could not stop Nerexes from marching to defeat, but he managed to salvage something from the disaster. When the Sturgians came over our barricades, he managed to lead a group of Nerexes guardmen out the back. My husband's small force held together. They were joined by stragglers and fugitives. He described the march back. No food, little water, marching day and night to stay on top of the enemy's riders. But they survived, only to be organized Imperial force to do so. O the only Imperial... Okay, the only organized Imperial force to do so. Got it. The city was in a state of panic after hearing rumors of what happened. Arrenikos kept things from descending into chaos. When it came time for the Senate to choose the next Emperor, there was no question it should be him. I loved him before as a man, but that day I learned to love him as something more. What a gift he was to the people of Calraria. Thank you. Alright, well, we've met everyone now. Um, let's talk to her a little bit. Uh, tell me about your politics. Well, let me put things this way. We are the family of the martyred emperor. Every man wishes to leave what he has to his children, be it a tiny patch of land or the imperial throne. Everyone in Calradia, rich or poor, grasps this. The universal principle of inheritance, not the obscure laws of the Senate, was what makes an emperor in the, right, in the eyes of the people. I will strive to be a good empress. I will do my best, but I know that whoever want, wins a civil war, landlords will still cheat tenants, city guards will still demand bribes, warriors will still kill men to steal their cattle, drunken husbands will beat bribes. The plague and labor of childbirth will take more lives than the evils of man put together. Still, men are willing to fight for me, though it gains them nothing, for other than the reason that the throne is my right. I will not betray these men. If I win in centuries to come, people will think back on my victory and think, Heaven smile on those that fight for their rights. Tis all one can hope to do. Nah. Nah. I wanted to like her, but I was kind of a weak, a weak pitch. Honestly, Lycon's the one that, uh, sorry, Lucon. Lucon is the one that's, uh, resonated with me the most. I think it's, I think it's Lucon. We gotta find him. Your pawns? Hello, sir. Let us find him. This is our last guy we to track down. We're gonna swear fealty to him and hope it works out well. Actually, let's go ahead and check on his location again. Um, we completed this quest, right? There's one left? Who are we missing? What? Who have we talked to? Thought that was all of them. We got Mochug and Regia. Weren't we at seven? Were we at only six? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Who's left? What? We? Oh, no. I thought we were done. Who's left? Who's left? There's ten kingdoms, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's only eight kingdoms? Who am I supposed to find this last person? How do I supposed to, is it Kaladog? Did we ever talk to Kaladog? Hang on, hang on, hang on. We never talked to Kaladog! I assume it's Kaladog who we need? It's the only person left I see a name for. We, maybe we heard Kaladog's name so much that I assumed that we had talked to him? Where's Kaladog? Where is he? Where's this boy at? Montos? Please be nearby. Where in the world is it? Oh no. Oh no, it's so not nearby. Well, we gotta get Kaladog's opinion, too. I doubt we'll like him. I haven't really liked that region in general, but I don't like the Batanians very much. That, that's really it. Uh, mainly because their tournaments are all fought with, like, one to two-handed axes and, like, nothing else, which I just didn't really care for. Uh, and so, the idea being, I want to like the tournaments where we are, because the tournaments are one of my favorite things to do in this game. And so I want to be in an area with tournaments that I really like. All right, we're close. We're, we're hunting him down. Please stay there for like two seconds, sir, at least. You can be Kaladog. Kaladog's army. Kaladog, are you with? Uh, are you with your army, or are you not with your army? It is Kaladog. All right, there. Hello, sir. May I ask your name? I'm Kaladog, High King of the Batanians, Lord of Lega Legeta and Moronath. Can you tell me anything about the Battle of Pendraic? I'm a busy man, but there is always time to talk about the battle, the blessed battle of Pendraic. The blessed battle. All right, well, he seems to be the first one we heard that really liked it. I do like his helmet. That's a pretty cool helmet. 
Ah, oh, dear beloved King Ariel, a wonderful man, but with a heart perhaps just a mite too tender, did not wish for us to go off to war. But then he disappeared, and I, his son-in-law, ascended to the kingship. The clans cried out for war. They had a hundred years of crimes against them to avenge, and I, a father to my people, gave them what they wanted. Now the Emperor uses tricks and traps in war. No Batanian fears to meet an Imperial soldier man to man, but we would thought it But we thought it would be a good laugh to use their tricks against them. So we laid an ambush, and both si on both sides of a wooded pass, wouldn't you know? They marched right into it. They turned and twisted as our arrows rained down upon them, like fish going frantic in a pond as you draw the net tighter. Then, when they were great, when they were greatly discomfited, we took upon our phalluxes, phalluxes and swords and reaped the harvest. Oh, there were some unpleasantries later with the Sturgians about the spoils of war, but what a grand old day it was! If you want more in information, there are two people you might speak to. Estania worked as a no sort of unofficial spy master for Nerzis. She lives near Apocrity, and there's Azragos, who has his bodyguard. He's supposed to be near Maranath. I heard he's changed quite a bit since then. All right, well, um. I would like to know about your feelings on politics. My family? I was adopted by the Fen Gruffendock, but really, I have no family. I was sent directly by the heavens as a gift to the Batanians. They didn't know it, but they- Okay, okay, he's pompous as heck, that's all I need to know. He thinks he's a gift from God, and uh, I don't like him. I don't like him, all right. We finally completed that quest. Uh, okay. These seem pretty optional. And, like, they're not going to be that big a deal. We'll let that happen in time. Now, the only thing left... Swear lo loyalty to Lucan. He was my favorite. On my first impressions, we're going with my gut. So, that's what we're going to do. Where are you at? I bet he's on the other side of the map. Lucan, where are you? Where are you? Lucan. Lucan? What? Oh, I clicked clans. Whoops. Uh, he... I don't actually remember what kingdom he's for. Ah, there he is. Lucan, where are you at, sir? Where are you at, my friend? Um... Yeah, so... He, he, yeah, he's against tyranny. I think that's pretty good. Um... Uh, don't love the idea that... Only landowners can have education, experience in government, and stake in property to really understand law, but... I mean... I think it's better than... I mean, none of them are great, right? There's some things I disagree with them with, but he's kind of old. is pretty young. You know, she, she'll be around for a while, uh, I think. Let's see. Hang on. So let, let's just let's just do a quick little inventory. Unkeed? Un uh, you know, I mean, I don't... I didn't mind Unkeed, but, you know, I think I think Lucan's the one I'm, I'm going to go with. You know, whoever we pick... Will we overthrow them eventually? Possibly. I also just like the area that he's located in, which is pretty cool. Uh, and so let's try and find him near Diamatha. Alright, there's at least a tournament. We'll do a tournament. Not for a helmet? Sure, I'll do it for some mittens, I guess. Uh, no. Our odds are not good enough to bother betting. Alright, well, uh, this is a good way to at least, you know, break up the monotony some. So I got... You're really not very good at this. 
I don't know how many times I've killed you. It's, it's a lot. All right, well, rip. Sorry, girl. Had to be done. Somebody had to do it to you. Oh, we're coming in. Hooga! Get that freebooter. How did they do so little damage? What the heck? How did we get through? That was a good bit of damage. Okay, that one did not work at all. Oh, what? How? I don't know what just hit him there. I did the wrong swing and it somehow got him. Okay, we're getting a little low here. We've already qualified, so it's not a big deal. How did you get through there? Wow, that did three damage and it killed him? I don't know. He just, like, swung through my shield, like, twice in that fight, I swear. Weird. Uh, No, don't leave. Join. All right. Uh, we got 2v2v2v2. Two 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 two. We got a bow. All right. Just protect our dude. That's all we got to do. Okay, sir. Picking a fight with me? You will regret this. I guarantee you I'm a better archer than you are. That was not good. Okay, well, uh... Oh, okay. Take this guy out, because he's going to focus on me now. Whew, headshot. All right, he's dead. Protect our boy. Help our boy. Okay, that was not good. Okay, that's fine. Just keep the pressure on, keep the pressure on. If he's got to worry about arrows, then he's got to worry about us. There we go. Stagger him. Get our, let, our, let our guy get a shot in. Oh, that's how you do it. You hit him right in the neck. Well. All right. Well done, sir. Well done. Good teamwork. Good teamwork. Join it up. All right. This is fine. We're going to get some crossbow men. Should be totally okay. Maybe our sword's bad. Maybe I haven't upgraded our sword in like a long time. But like they give me... I don't even have... I don't choose the weapons here. This is the sword, just a sword that they give me. So it is weird that you get your own armor, but not your own weapons in these. We're going for an overhead strike next. Yeah, there it is. Left side. Oh, how did that block? What? Shield was nowhere near that, sir. Okay, that's fine. We did one damage, only took seven. That's fine. Not a great trade, but okay enough. Overhead. Give him the over... Oh, that was supposed to be overhead. Overhead! There it is. They never block the overheads very well. They do occasionally, but for the most part, you can trick them with that. I think, like, the center block tends to block left, right, and forward, so you can get it with an overhead a little bit easier there. Give me my mittens! I want my mittens! Give me a little stab in the face! Oh, it didn't work. Woohoo! There it did. I'm not very good at hitting them in the body. I'm really only good at hitting in the head. You turning your back on me, sir? That's the biggest problem with these guys, is they just don't turn very quickly. They just do this, and it's too slow. Alright, easy enough. Got ourselves some sweet mittens. Uh, we'll see if those stack up well against our uh, existing mittens. Let's see. Uh, are the mittens better than the van braces? They are better. So sure, we'll throw those on. We'll give Para our previous mittens. Uh, she's probably gonna be the one that's gonna take our squad and go off on her own eventually. So that's why I want to give her uh, the most stuff. Um, we said we had leveled up here. Ah, we now get a one-handed skill. Uh, 4% damage or extra vigor, or wait, or HP increased by 3? Three? 3 HP? That doesn't seem worth it. 4% damage? I think I like that. Yeah, let's go 4% damage. I think that's going to make a bigger difference um, than the 4, the 3 HP. That seems a bit, little bit small potatoes, you know. Um, I do like that we leveled up, though. It feels pretty good. Been a while. And uh, where is my guy? Where is my guy? I mean, I kind of like that he doesn't sit still. I think, it, you know, it shows that he's a very active guy. He's out there doing work, putting in work. And I think that's the kind of guy we want to work for. But at the same time, it's super annoying. How did we miss you? You went from here to there and we went from here to there. How did we miss you? You can't go through here. There's only one way. What? Nonsense. We're heading towards Diathema. That's got to be where he's heading. Nonsense. Nonsense. All right. Stop tracking this thing. Stop tracking this. Stop tracking that. Get rid of all these things. All right, that's a good way to get rid of them. That's much easier than pointing at the map. Please remain in your stupid town. Lucan! Lucan! I saw him this time. I saw him. Please. Please. Lucan! No! I clicked on Lucan, not the town! Please! Lucan. Hunt him down! Hunt him down! Sir, I wish to work for you. Hello, it's been a while. It has. Uh, I would like to discuss something. I would like to enter your service. How would I serve you? Uh, um, 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 um. So would I like to... Have him like be like, I will, you can pay me, or like to be like, 
I want to be your loyal followers. I think I want to be his loyal follower. You were known as a brave warrior and a fine leader of men, Nicias. I shall be pleased to accept your sword into my service, if you are ready to swear homage to me. We're ready. I said I promised you by the end of this episode, we're swearing loyalty to him. I am ready, Lucan. Good. Then repeat the words of the oath to me. I swear by my ancestors that you are lawful right, the lawful rightful emperor of the Calradians. I swear by my ancestors that you are the lawful rightful emperor of the Calradians. I affirm that you are executor of the will of the senate and people. I affirm that you are the executor of the will of the senate and people. Furthermore, I accept induction into the army of Calradia at the rank of Archon. That's a cool sounding rank. Furthermore, I accept the induction of the, into the army of Calradia at the rank of Archon. As such, that you are my commander, and I shall follow you wherever you lead. As such, that you are my commander, and I shall follow you wherever you lead. Very well, you have given me your solemn oath. Nicias, may, it, may you uphold it always, with proper courage and devotion. I proclaim, proclaim you a citizen of the Empire, and the rank of Senator. We're a Senator now? What? I am the Senate? That's pretty sick. I knew we made the right choice with, with uh, Luke on here. Your life and prosperity shall be protected by, your, by our laws, and shall not be taken from you except by law. You may serve as a magistrate over towns and villages, and as a general over armies, if we call you to do so. You have done a wise thing, Nicias. Serve me well, and I promise you, you will rise high. I thank you, my lord. I have great hopes for you, Nicias. I know you shall prove yourself worthy of the trust I have placed in you. Is there anything else? Well, uh, I have a quick question. Nothing? I'd like to discuss something. Um... Well, how do I do things for you? Do I get missions from you? Do you just... Ooh, look at that! We got a new color now, because they're all... Ooh. Okay, so they're at war with these guys, which is fine, because I didn't like them anyway. That's fine with me, and that's the only ones that they're at war with? Seems ideal. So it seems like there's going to be a lot of action in this area then. So that's where we're, uh, we're going to head. Do I just, like, capture places in your name now, sir? Can I... Do I have the right to do that? I'm a senator! That's sick! Oh, who knew that House Skateboard was going to be joining the Senate? I told you, told you we were going to get involved in the uh, the politics game here. Let's see if we can't find one more tournament to end things off on a positive note. Not that that wasn't a pretty positive note, but you know me, I like tournaments. That's how we're going to try to end every episode. I'm a Thor and Apocrite? Sure. I think we'll head to a, towards Apocrite. Though maybe the other one was closer? Uh, where was the other one? I'm a more... Uh, 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 maybe he said Onira. Uh, well, we'll head to Apocrates right here. We'll come over to Apocrates right quick, do at least one more uh, tournament, and I guess we'll see if he sends us some missions. But we're a senator now, dude. That's pretty sick. I'm happy about that. Uh, I like I like that title. We get we get to make all sorts of pre prequel memes about it, and uh, I'm I'm super excited. Hopefully you're looking forward to it too. Hopefully you think I made a right choice in uh, trusting Lucan here. He seemed like a pretty decent guy. I like this area. It's near our homeland. Uh, I do not mind paying, like, playing this for armor. I will gladly do some of this for armor. We're on horseback. We cannot be stopped. Uh, we just got stopped a little bit. Ooh, nine damage. That's actually more than I thought. I thought we were going to miss entirely, so I'll take it. Take this guy out. Seven damage. Come on. I didn't think we were going to hit very well, but I thought we hit better than that. Take this guy out. 75? I'll take 75. 70, that's pretty good. 75 going once. 75 going twice. 75! Sold for 92 damage. Alright. Take out this archer. Everybody's super low. 95. Alright. 95, 95, 95 going once. Alright. Stop that. The weird auctioneer thing. It's not a funny bit. Just let it go. Take this guy out. Ooh! Andrea! I'm sorry, girl. I put a spear through your head. Uh, it's super strange that people survived this. Because uh, like, I was not holding back there. I was going for broke and... Uh, murdering people. We missed. I thought we had that. I really did. thought we had threaded that needle. Help our guys out. Take out Karsten. I think it was Karsten. Oh, wow. We just missed. Wow! I, can't believe we... I thought for sure that was not going to hit. Can't believe we made that one work. Three damage. We got him, boys. We got him. Alright. Oh, I hit the horse. Dang it. I don't really care about hitting the horse. Honestly, I find it harder to hit them when they're off of horseback than I do when they're on horseback, so I'd rather not hit the horses. Woo, Karsten. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. All right, let's take this person out for 105. 103. I was so close to actually guessing that amount of damage. Dang. Super, super close. All right. Well done, guys. Well done. Joining this next round. We're on foot. That's fine. Please, sir, move slower. Sir, I need you to go slower. 
The only way we lose is if it becomes 2v1. Alright, now we can't lose. Can't lose now. It's a 2v1 in our favor, so... Totally fine. One damage. Ah! Ah! Good job, sir. Good job. I was trying to injure him because I know we're against him in this next round. We're betting on ourselves. We know we're going to win. Why not Why not earn a little money off of it? There's no way this random dude takes me out when it's a sword and shield thing. Look at his armor. It's garbage. 66 damage. Yeah, this guy's dead. This guy's dead. I shouldn't underestimate him that much, but, like, come on. But, like, but like come on. Come on. All right. Good episode. Good episode. Swore fealty. You bet we're going to try and get involved and figure out what this guy wants us to do for him. Um, I, I don't know. We're not sure what'll happen next, but uh, we will figure it out along the way. Take up these last couple of recruits, fill up our party totally there, and uh, yeah, we'll call it done with that. Like I promised you, we have sworn our fealty, saving that progress. We are now committed to Lycon. Uh, Lucon, sorry, Lucon. Look at that house skateboard banner. Ooh, it changed our colors. Not sure how I feel about that. I do like these colors. To be fair, I like these colors, so it could be worse. You know what? I actually like these colors a lot. It's growing on me. If I were to pick other colors from the ones on this map, it'd probably be this one, this one, or this one, or this one. And I think this is pretty solid. So, you know, it could be worse, but it's no longer the channel colors. It's all right, though. Hopefully, Lucon treats us well. Hopefully, we can start earning ourselves some cities, uh, towns. We'll start with villages and towns. Then we'll move up to cities or castles, then cities, maybe? Uh, but we'll be in charge of a castle before too long. You got that much, uh... Guarantee. That's the nice guarantee. It only took us 15 or so episodes to get ourselves sworn to somebody, but hey, gotta make sure we find all the dudes. And it was a, a task to track them all down. That's it for this episode, though. Hopefully, you're still enjoying the series. I'm certainly having a blast. Hopefully, you are too. If you are, hit that like button for me. Subscribe to see some more of these in the future. There is a brand new episode of something on this channel every single day at 9 a.m. Eastern Time. Until the next episode, I hope you have a nice day. Thank you so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, check out these similar videos floating all around your screen.